And now to the breaking news in Irving. In the huge effort to free a person trapped in a trench, that person has been freed. It's happening on her drive, and that's where our Robbie Owens joins us live. Robbie, there had been some rain in that area a little while ago. And rain right now, Christian. It made for a messy rescue effort, but ultimately a successful one here. You can see the couple of dozen fire crews here from both Irving and Capel washing away all the mud, getting cleaned up here. But they tell me that these rain showers that we've gotten in the past half hour, hour or so, actually helped to loosen that heavy soil that was trapping that worker and ultimately helped them free him sooner than they had expected. That worker had been stuck in a waste deep soil, heavy shifting clay soil since about one o'clock this afternoon. The worker, he was a staffer with a local foundation company, and they were working to dig a drainage ditch alongside this commercial building here. A fire department official tells us that the workers reported hearing a noise that alarmed them, and suddenly the soil gave way. Too often, they tell us, such scenes turn into recovery rather than rescue missions because collapsing soil is just so dangerous. One cubic yard of soil can weigh up to 2,000 pounds. And when we have sloughing or what we call breaking loose of the soil, it can move at a speed of 45 miles an hour. So the human can't get out of the way of that. When it starts to fall, it falls extremely quickly. And normally, if it, if it catches someone above the waist around the lungs, it just squeezes you. As you exhale, it just squeezes you till you can't breathe anymore. Now, fortunately, as we reported, that worker was in waist deep soil, so he was conscious and alert throughout this rescue. Uh, tire of t fire technical rescue teams from both Irving and Capel worked together on this rescue this afternoon. They brought in this huge piece of equipment that acted just like a huge vacuum, and the, and the rain that we got this afternoon actually loosened that soil a little bit, kept it a little cooler for those firefighters down about eight feet below grade level working to rescue that worker. And it loosened that soil and helped, again, just to free him just a little bit sooner this afternoon. So a, a difficult, a messy, but a very successful rescue effort here that's just wrapping up in Irving. Reporting live, Robbie Owens, CBS 11 News.